Hello, friends. I just wanted to give a little update. It's the uh, second week of November, just started it, and uh, I've had some life changes. Uh, my wife and I moved from our our home of 17 years, our house, uh, to another kind of midpoint home. It wasn't going to be our final destination, but it was a stopping point. And now we're moving uh, from there to a, a ranch. We purchased a ranch and uh has a nice pond on it and views that go on for uh, 40 miles in one direction and, and even more in the other. And it's just, it's just, we love it. It's beautiful. It's remote as can be. And I am relaxed. And kind of the point of this video is to say, or to suggest that we each examine how much news, how much information how much research that we want to ingest? How much do we want to do? How much do we want to learn? And there's a saying, as, as you have heard, ignorance is bliss. And I've been experiencing that the last month or so. <clears throat> I've somewhat removed myself from reading even Facebook news or telegram things that are happening. And I've just focused on doing productive things like renting a mini excavator and digging a big long trench to put electric into the, the house, um, dealing with little things, just little things that real people do. Uh, I'm building a, a shed, a 16 by 30 foot shed. And I, I don't know how to build stuff. I'm a city slicker kind of guy. I'm a I'm a behind the computer, read a book, write a book kind of guy. I don't go out and do that kind of stuff, but I'm learning. And I'm messing up a lot. And uh, of course, I love that because I learn from it. My hands are dirty. I'm exhausted. My joints hurt. My muscles hurt. And I feel at peace. I, I haven't looked at vaccine stuff or mask stuff. I, I don't wear a mask. I see that other people, some other people choose to, but I don't wear a mask. I don't want to get vaccinated. I haven't gotten vaccinated. I don't intend to get vaccinated. That used to be really heavy on my mind. And since moving out into very remote country, it's no longer on my mind. And I feel so much better. Is that good? I don't know. I guess that's the point of this video isn't to tell you that it's good to, to bury your head in the sand and do nothing. Or on the other hand, to be really busy and active and vote harder or, or do some sort of activism. But I can tell you that being busy, doing human being real work has sure been good for my brain. It's cleared my head. It's, uh, it's relaxed me. It's frustrated me at times. And then, you know, the whole learning process is a challenge of uh, all the little things I didn't know about how to square a shed. Uh, this whole thing, the six, eight, 10 rule, who knew that, right? Uh, I'm learning all these little things and it's just wonderful. And uh, my mind is feeling good. And I'm not telling you, you should do the same thing. Not everybody is in a, in a position to take a little bit of time off and, and develop the old homestead. Uh, but I'm really enjoying doing that. And it's really been good for me. And uh, I'm sure I'll be back once the snow buries us here in a couple of weeks. Uh, other than plowing the big long driveway several times a day, I'm going to have lots of time on my hands and I, I think I'll be back and producing more content at that time. So thank you guys for hanging in there and, uh, listening to the wonderful, uh, logical fallacies that Mickey has been doing a great job editing for us and, uh, really appreciate you checking those out and sharing those. And I'll see you again soon with more content.